Flabby Jr. and Buchanan on line number two. Then it's Reichstein and Brown on line number three. Kerry Weston lurking back there in the 17. Alongside him, Keith Moore in the three. We are set for MJS Street Stock. A main time. Into turn number one they go. A very good start from Thorne here, but look at Flatty. Flatty trying to make it happen here. Drew Flap and a bit of understeer going into three. Darren Brumfield in the 91. He drops back into third position. Craig Buchanan in the seven, running fourth. They run wide open down the back straight. Craig Buchanan looking fairly racy in the SA lift and loader number seven. And we are under caution. We have uh, one car facing in the wrong direction here on the back chute. Next up is Ryan Buchanan in the 11. In fact, Mick Dan starts just ahead of him, I stand corrected. And then it's back to Curtis Brown in the 24. Followed by Darren Flatman in the 12. The six car. And tucked in behind him, we've got Jolly followed by Reese Buchanan. But I tell you what, our race leader with uh, 22 laps remaining, he's absolutely taking the big stick to them here. Oh, Flatty's in trouble. Drew Flatman in the National Karate Centre's entry is out of commission. Tough break for the young man after last night's victory. Craig Buchanan continuing to shadow his every move. Only one to two car legs separating them. Nick Dan, the, uh, the rusty. Had a feeling this may well have been a competition caution. And that's exactly as it's panning out to be. So that is your top seven or so. A flicker of orange and then we're straight onto the green. Hostilities resuming here at the MJS Tree and Stump Removal Street Stock Series. And we are back under yellow. Well that one, uh, it was a little strange I've got to admit. There was a flicker of amber, then it was replaced with the green. Stein may need to uh, move upstairs a little bit, although Dan now does move up the track a little bit. Seems to be good on the uh, initial start as we've got the 97 pointing in the wrong direction for a moment, but we stay green. Nitro Nate, the Nate dog about to get on the gas pedal here with nine laps remaining. Buchanan has a bit of a look, it's as close as he's been. Nick Dan, he's getting a bit excited as well there in third place. Nige Reichstein in position uh, number four. Another lap in the books. Curtis Brown in the 24, he's back there in fifth. Then we look back to Grant Harris in the six. Harris showing a fair bit of pace late in this feature. He looks to go around the outside of Brown, but uh, Brown just moves upstairs. Three laps now remaining. Thorne continuing to lead Buchanan, sitting about six car lengths in arrears in second. Mick Dan there in position number three. High drag Stein in four. Curtis Brown still five, then it's back to Grant Harris in six. Ah, quite a challenging car to drive these street stocks as well with a very narrow tires and the uh, ribs on these cars that they certainly do squirm around a fair bit. You've got to be particularly smooth to get the most out of them. So half a lap now remaining. Nitro, Nathan Thorne. He's about to come around and taste success in the MJS Tree and Stump Removal Series. He takes the double checkers. 
Congratulations, what a great drive. Craig Buchanan gets across into second position in the seven for SA Lift and Loader. Third place will go to Mick Dan, fourth to the 14 of Nifty Nige Reichstein. They were followed by Curtis Brown, Grant Harris, and the uh, 25 of Jaden Ruse. He was in there somewhere. Aiden Jolly's just spun after the uh, Checkers. The 97, Nick Hill, he was also in there amongst it. And the uh, 11 of Ryan Buchanan, he was a uh, little bit subdued after he was uh, put to the rear of the field. So we're just waiting now for the winner of this one. Nitro Nathan Thorne to get the chequered flag and set off on his victory lap.